Welcome back my outdoor and hiking friends. Uh, we are on a van tour and we have stopped at Vetterlings Yxfabrik. It's an axe factory uh, here in Sweden. So here you see the Vetterling axe factory. It's a famous one. It's one of the oldest of three. You have the Gränsforsbruk, Vettelings, Yxfabrik, and you also have Hulta Fors axes. And this particular one is very close to where I'm hunting and from where I have my roots. That's why I think this is very interesting. And this summer we also stopped at Gränsforsbruk. Everyone that knows about axes knows about, about Gränsfors as well. Vetterlings are today owned by uh, Gränsforsbruk. So they cooperate with a factory shop in here as well. And they also cooperate with the manufacturing of axes. Here we see a part of the uh, factory. And uh, the river that originally drive the mill to the forge. Interesting is that uh, instead of driving the forge that in the old days this water dam and fall drives hydropower turbines that drives the forge by electricity of course and also solar power I was told so this is very interesting. Let us get into the factory shop and see what's in there. Really nice. Uh, they had a nice package price of this uh, on ca campaign. It's a, uh, I don't know what this is in English, it's a Klyvyxa, Stor Klyvyxa, really nice one. And as well, a nice outdoor axe from Gränsforsbruk. And this is actually made here at Vettelings, at this particular factory. So, this is really cool. And as well a grinding stone for the axe. So nice and local shopping so to speak. So I hope you found this video interesting and uh, 
if you like access and uh, have the opportunity, you should visit these uh, forges, Gränsforsbruk or Vetterlings. It's really interesting and uh, see you on the next one. One more cool thing is that this is my old Vetterlings axe since I got it as a present in the 90s by Bibi's brother. At this factory I got this edge protection from the Vetterlings factory today. That was a bonus on, on this shopping. Really nice of the lady in the store. Really nice split axe, I must say. Does the job very easy. Just falls down and split the wood without that much force needed. Really nice. So cool that I got it in a very nice and attractive package price at the factory outlet. This rear end of the axe handle has a rougher texture than the rest of this uh, handle or shaft. That's to get a better grip. Really cool. It's so much easier with the right tool for the right situation. And this outdoor axe, I have tried it out today when in the forest to cut some branches and, and so on so lightweight but even so really nice to work with <laughs> both of decks are of course razor sharp but yeah I really like this outdoor axe performs very well actually for being for being so small. Oh, made the job perfectly as well. This old wetlings that I got in the 90s as a gift from my brother-in-law. Perfect little backpack X in the forest as well. I think this one will be my new favorite actually. Huh? It has a slightly longer handle this outdoor axe. Really nice. It is uh, remarkable how easy the work gets done when you use the right tool, isn't it? <laughs> 